Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Topics with me, where today we're going to be doing something just a little bit different. Now, I have talked about tech in the past, and this is kind of like an indicator before I play the intro, but I wanted to kind of go in that direction and talk about why people are talking about technology more than they did before, and what specifically the best to start with is... I'm going to start the intro at this point because I don't want to spoil it for you guys, okay? Roll it. My name is Derek Amal and I am proud to be. I'm in another town with my family. And so I found a place where everyone will be. Let's talk discreetly. This is Topics with me. So. I was thinking, all these two weeks I didn't do any topics with me, all the, these two weeks where I didn't make a video, I, I'm sorry, I was a little busy, you know, I've been working all week and I usually don't make videos during the weekday, but what I was thinking about is there's been a lot of tech stuff, uh, re relating tech stuff that's been happening. Huawei got banned from uh, the US because Google uh, saw that they were stealing their secrets. Uh, there was one with... Oppo and these small little companies that are rising up and creating new trends rather than Apple and the Apple iPhone 11 Pro Max yeah and Pro and the original 11 it's very complicated and I'll talk about it right here so first off the naming scheme most people thought that it was not going to be called the Pro or the Max I don't know why they even called it like that I mean, Max was even odd from last year. Why not? Why add in the extra, extra stuff? It, it got weird. So uh, I, I'm not going to blame Apple because pretty much they want to be a futuristic company. They want to look forward. And when they removed the headphone jack, especially from the iPhone 7 and I got one, I thought that I couldn't live with that one. Now, I can't still, but I would rather live with one than without one. It's it's complicated with me. I'm, I'm kind of in the middle. So most people that don't know, I made videos on my mom's iPhone 6s and I thought that that, that was what I would buy or get pretty soon, but I ended up getting the 7, so I ended up uh, having to switch everything earlier than I thought I would, which meant that I had to get an adapter, which I can't find at the moment. Hmm. So I use now Bluetooth and its related services. I usually don't plug it in through the bottom. I'm trying to find ways around it, but it's not easy if you don't, if you can't really go out and buy stuff. And then if you go and buy stuff, it's not easy to keep them by you. It's it, this little small adapter. It's not. It's it's not good. It's not a good situation. So I have to deal with that issue myself. I know that people move on with the notch and everything. The only thing that I was having problem with the notch is the aspect ratio of recording with your phone and the video. When you were watching a video, it would obscure it. But Apple fixed it with its three tap method. It still doesn't have that in earlier versions of the iOS 11 updates because they never added that in. But they now added it in. I'm very happy because if I ever decide to switch to one of those notchful phones, I don't have to worry about it obstructing the way, which I won't get for a while. I mean, probably they're, they're probably going to stay for a while. But the aspect ratio, it's not 16 by 9 if you record. You see, the notch is there physically, but when you're talking about the phone and when you're screen recording, that's a whole nother deal, okay? It has this little area, gap. Wherever you go, it's just going to be just empty right in the middle um, if, if you're screen recording it and any type of third party or second party anything the uh, software automatically does that it doesn't have a notch there because you know it's 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 just there in case someone wants to screen record and they don't want to you know yeah anyway besides that point I just want to say that the cameras were updated on the iPhone 11 and they finally have 4k on the front screen so I might upgrade in two years um, I know that's a long time which means that I'll have to pay a little bit in uh, battery replacement and screen replacement because I'm having a few issues with my screen that I, me as a perfectionist, want to fix. So I, I'll probably update in a few years and I'll, I'll definitely make an unboxing video about it. Don't think I won't. I'll probably also get an Apple Watch and a 
a pair of AirPods. I don't know what I'd do with an iPad, a HomePod, and a TV, Apple TV. I don't know what I'd do with all that. I might pay for Apple Music. I just might. But I'm, I'm not going to pay for a Mac. I won't pay for all those things because it's just not my preferred platform. You see, there's some things on Windows that Mac, at least right now, doesn't do. If they do it, sure. But I like Windows all the way, as you guys can see. So it's not a... I don't like them for everything thing. It's just, it's not my preference. I'd, I'd rather find a way to have the things that I need to not have it. You see what I'm saying? So this is the type of the, this is the time of the video where at every end of the video I, I shout people out and I basically just tell you what's going on in my life. I currently work at a job, a McDonald's, very close to me. I'm not going to say which one. Because I don't want you guys coming and visiting, okay? People people do that sometimes. I work there and I've basically started, you know, getting used to the to the schedule and everything. I still don't have a permanent schedule, but by next week I should. And I have to make up hours for the days that I went off. Unless I get paid for those days. Hmm. I'm, I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking I could take overtime next week and then... Maybe the week after that, but I have to see if I'm getting paid for it. it it's, a, it's a whole thing, but it's not going to affect my video making because I had an option to pick weekends and I didn't. I would make big, big money during the weekends, but I, I know that it would be too big of a compromise for you guys. And I don't want to see my channel just kind of go down and diminish over nothing. So I specifically reserved weekends to channels and driving time and... Uh, what social media and stuff like that, free time for myself, all that stuff. So, yeah, I mean, I, I do really, really care about you guys. I want to inspire you to create your own videos one day. I want to be that person. So please, please support this video. And I know I say it a lot, but please, I would really appreciate it. That's all I'm trying to say, okay? Um, so please like, subscribe, comment, leave suggestions in the comments and the description below because it really does help me. I know it, I say that a lot, but it really, really does. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye okay? P.S. Look out for that flu, okay? That flu does not play those games.